sound person down. I'm JC, I'm one of the co-founders of Movember. We are a global men's health organisation, the world's largest men's health organisation at the moment. You know, every day we wake up and we get to wake up and change the world a little bit better. London is a great town, I mean, London has so much going on, which I love, and so much diversity and hanging out, so it's now become my home in London. I'm actually a, a British citizen now, so um, I've, uh, I didn't think that would happen, but yeah, this is uh, definitely my home now. The moustache had vanished from the face of the earth when we decided to bring it back in 2003. So anyone under the age of probably your grandfather's age wasn't growing moustaches, so it was a weird thing to start doing. And the rules of Movember are you have to clean shave and then you start growing a little bit of stubble above your top lip. And that starts to create obviously amazing questions over the first 10 days because it looks like you've just missed a spot shaving. And then that creates conversation. Why are you growing a moustache? What are you doing? And then they can talk about the journey of why they're growing a moustache, what they're growing a moustache for. And it's a really good, we call it the walking, talking billboard that is Movember. I thought I was quite fortunate with my facial hair. A lot of guys, it would take forever to grow a moustache. So I was quite happy with my uh, skill set of moustache growing. But one of the weirdest ones was a guy actually did a thing called a cat's tail. He actually grew it and then grew it all the way up into his head and then rolled it into a cat's tail. And it wasn't joined and it was just this different coloured moustache that was uh, like a cat's tail on his top of it. Since we've been rolling out, we've raised over 438 million pounds. We've got over a thousand projects on the go to get men to start taking action. Because we have this really good connect because we are guys, breaking down who guys are. I've got lots of family. I've got family now who have prostate cancer who didn't when we started the journey, but it's been great to help them through that. I had a mate just email me this morning who he's found out his dad has prostate cancer. Um, we've lost a lot of friends to suicide, um, which isn't great, obviously, and that's why we're gonna stop it, and that's why we started what we're doing. We have over five million people who look you know, who are MoBros and MoSisters, our citizens across the world. So every day we're faced with that and faced with how people get through the diseases they're handling and how men can live not only just longer lives, but how they can live happier, healthier lives. Just walk for 30 minutes a day. That's all they have to do. We can offset so many diseases from reduce the risk of diabetes, Alzheimer's, heart, everything. big stuff to bite off in the next uh, coming years and we're looking forward to that journey. Click the videos to watch more Londoners and don't forget to subscribe.